weeks of high heat and little rain being blamed for several fire fight, um, fires in the western United States. And the biggest one is the Oak Fire. It's in Northern California near Yosemite National Park. Trinity Chavez reporting how firefighters are finally, though, starting to get this one under control. The Oak Fire raging on in California's bone dry brush now for the fifth consecutive day. In a statement released last night, CAL FIRE said it was a successful day for aircraft and firefighters, resulting in minimal growth on the fire. This morning, uh, we reported 10% containment on the fire. Uh, tonight, we're reporting 16% containment. So, you know, it's not a huge number, but it's a pretty big percentage jump. The Oak Fire broke out Friday and quickly spread to over 17,000 acres just west of Yosemite National Park. It's already destroyed more than 50 homes and other buildings, while forcing thousands of residents to evacuate. I'm exhausted. I am just very exhausted. Officials said dry, windy conditions in the area helped fuel the flames, which followed the path of a major 2018 wildfire. It's actually buttoned up against an old burn scar, the old Ferguson fire. So that has slowed it down. The vegetation there is, um, is not as dense as it is where it has not burned. While in Texas, at least 20 homes have been damaged or completely destroyed in a grass fire that spread across a suburban Dallas field. Investigators believe it may have been started by a spark from a lawnmower blade that struck an object on the ground. Trinity Chavez, CBS News, New York. Let's bring it home here. Let's look at uh, what's going on in Nevada, uh, represented by red circles on the map. That's where the fires are within our state. The larger the circle, the larger the fire. Fire, And you can see there are several incidents here, most of them, though, happening in the northern part of the state.